Joshua Roar, eleven fifty one Bridge Street, Shelby, North Carolina. Um, you know I'm here. Um, came back because seems nothing's been done in seven months, and um, why? Why has nothing been done? Why has there been no accountability? Why has there been no transparency? Y'all have literally spent $1.2 million to buy more tasers and more body cameras and aren't even releasing the footage that you do have. And I can't do this. I'm having a really hard time because I don't have my service dog anymore. Nobody knows what that's like unless they've been through it. And you've got to release that footage. You have to. I don't deserve what happened to me, and Sunshine does not deserve what happened to her. They should have never separated us. They went out of their way to separate us and laugh at me. They thought it was funny that their fellow officers tased the service dog. That doesn't sound like behavior of a public servant. And you said to mind who we're talking to, y'all are public servants. And you rolled your eyes when he said that 17 homeless people had died in the town. You seem so disinterested in this conversation and everything that we have to say. And when I talked to the police officers, I asked them how they're doing and talked to them and they want to get an attitude and I get their name. They're public servants. When you say something to them and you ask what their name and badge number is, they're supposed to tell you. You work for the public. But you got an attitude with me. You not so much. You weren't happy with what I had to say to you. But you're not serving the public. You shut down Pastor Moses' homeless shelter, the only one in the town, and all these people are dying. Why would you do that? And you're opening this meeting with prayer? <laughs> Talking about grace? Where's the grace? And you're talking about opening a fire station, which is important. But what about the homeless shelter? Y'all spent so much time talking about that, but how long y'all spent talking about the homeless task force and the homeless problem? Y'all are out there dozing homeless camps with bulldozers while people were still in the tent. It doesn't look good on y'all. It really doesn't. I don't even know what else to say, but thank you for your time.